Welcome back to the Pleasants, and in today's economy, inflation is at an all-time high. However, we have three fast food giants in Burger King, Wendy's, and McDonald's that have introduced a $5 meal deal. Today, we're going to be checking out these $5 meal deals to see which one has the best. So we're at our first spot, Burger King. Everything in the world has gotten so expensive, but now we have $5 meal deals. So right over here, as you can see, at Burger King, it's called the $5 Have Your Way meal. As you can see, it's a limited time only deal. It's a great deal for today's economy. As you can see right over here, we'll start off with this. So you have your choice of a Whopper Junior, Chicken Junior, or a Bacon Cheeseburger. I think it's only right that we try both the Whopper and the Chicken at every single spot so we can find which meal is the best out of all of them. So let's start with the Whopper Junior. Next, no customizations, we're gonna go as is. And then next, you get to choose your sauce. I think I'm gonna have to go with the barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce or the nuggets. So next is fries, value onion rings, or even halfsies. I think we gotta go halfsies for the drink. As you can see, they have many different options. I'll go with the zero sugar Coca-Cola, add to bag. So let's take a look. We got our nuggets, we got our fries, we got our drink, and we got our first Whopper. Let me add the chicken sandwich and let's see how they taste. So we're at our first spot, Burger King, and we got two different $5 have it your way meals. Have so, it your way. So they've never had this before, right? They've never had this. So I know Wendy started off with the $5 biggie bag, but now we have Burger King and McDonald's stepping into the game because fast food's expensive. I go to fast food places, I spend 15, 20 bucks. So wait, basically they're competing to see who has the best $5 meal. And we actually have a lot of food here. Romel, why don't you break it down? So over here, you get to pick your own burger or chicken sandwich. I got this okay. chicken right over here. They have a choice for half seeds. I, wow. I didn't know Burger King had this. Yeah. I thought Jack in, the Box, Jack in the Box was the only one. But you get onion rings, and you get fries, you get nuggets, your choice of sauce, and a drink. Actually, a good amount of food for $5. So break it down, Should we? what do you want to try out first? I think we got to start off with a classic. The classic. Whopper okay. Jr. All right, so first we're gonna start off with the Whopper Jr. and the chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. I normally don't come to Burger King often, but when I do, it's usually pretty good. Yeah. It's solid. just a little out of the way for me. Yeah, 100%. Okay, just off of looks. Looks pretty solid. It's your standard American fast food burger. It has onions, pickles, tomatoes, lettuce. It's a little bit on the small side. As you can see, it fits in the palm of my hand. Yeah. Pretty tiny. And chicken sandwich. It looks like chicken, lettuce, mayo. That's about it. All right, cheers. Okay. Solid. Burger, you can actually taste the charbroil on it. Oh, really? Yeah, it has that smokiness. Try it. Oh, Actually, really good. Chicken, and the chicken looks amazing. Let me see it all. Chicken reminds me of a McChicken sandwich from McDonald's. L literally the same exact thing. Mm. Okay. You taste the charbroil? Uh-huh. Yeah. Overall, solid. I would say the burgers and the chicken sandwich, pretty good. Yeah, you can't go wrong with either choice. I think the burger's a little bit better than the chicken sandwich. Yeah, I think it's cool they give you the option between both. Yeah, you can 100%. Hit either one. And then next off, nuggets. Nugget? Oh, I like I've, it. Okay, I'm I've, more of a chicken nugget type of person. So I've never had nuggets at Burger King. I wish they gave you the chicken fries. Have you ever had the chicken fries? Oh, they just brought those bad boys back. <laughs> oh, those are good. But look, I want to show you something real quick. They actually have the same shape as McDonald's. Yeah, you see the similar. little boot, and it has the same type of nugget. Right, there we go. Let's try this out. I got the zesty sauce. I've never had this. I've never had that, so I'll try that out first, and then go with the ranch. All right, well, cheers. Cheers. It's almost it's Wendy's s. Yeah. You know what I mean? It doesn't have that distinct McDonald's outside crunch to the chicken nugget. Yeah. Still, it's not overly crispy, but very well seasoned. Very well seasoned. Uh, the zesty sauce, that was very unique. I don't think, what is that, like a mustardy? Uh, it was like a honey mustard. It was it was definitely zesty. I'll tell you, these nuggets definitely need a sauce. Yeah. You can't just eat those raw. Yeah. That one needs a sauce, but we should go over to the french fries and the onion rings now. All right, so this caught me by surprise half seas at Burger King. I don't think I've ever had the onion rings. I've actually never had the onion rings from here. I've, I've had fries before, not the onion rings. I didn't know they had onion rings, but here, cheers. Yeah. Let's just go raw. I'm gonna go raw. Oh. A little too much breading, mm -hmm. I would say. You're not getting enough onion, but solid. Solid. It's a good change up because you get a little bit of fries right after. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fries, let me see. Oh. Ooh. I actually don't really like the fries. Yeah. I've had way better fries elsewhere. Yeah. I would say the fries are mid. Overall, Romel, what are you giving this meal? 
Out of 10. Out of 10 on a fast food like scale, I'll give it a 7.5. 7.5. I like the flexibility. You can choose from between a burger, okay. a chicken sandwich, you get the half seas, you get your nuggets, they're yep. solid. I'm but gonna give this a 6.5. A 6.5? 6.5, which puts Burger King at a total of seven. It's a great start to the video. I think we should go to McDonald's next and see what they got. All right guys, we just pulled up to McDonald's and I am very excited to try their $5 meal deal. So let's come over here to the self-service ordering and you go right here, there's meal deals. So let's click the meal deals. There is three different options. We got the $5 McChicken meal deal. We got the $5 hot and spicy McChicken meal deal. And then we have a $6 McDouble meal deal. And for me personally, I'm gonna go, you might, might as well go with the hot and spicy McChicken meal deal. Let's click on that one. Sauces, I'm a ranch type of guy, so let's go creamy ranch. Drinks, you know the diet starts tomorrow, so Diet Coke. Let's go ahead and order this bad boy, add it to the cart with tax. Oh, $5, there's no tax? That's it? Like I said, it's a $5 meal deal, all right, cool. All right guys, it is time to try our $5 meal deal here at McDonald's. We got the hot and spicy chicken sandwich with the four chicken nuggets, the fries, and then we also got, what else did we get? We got the $6 one too. Oh, we actually, yeah, I convinced Ali we need to try the $6 one. Yes. Although it's not $5, I mean, it's worth to try, you know? It's worth it, we're already here. So should we start off with the $5 one? Yeah. All right, hot and spicy chicken sandwich. It's actually crazy how this meal is only $5. And other fast food restaurants are competing with this and have their own $5 menu as well. It is crazy. Like Ramel mentioned yeah. earlier, uh, inflation has been crazy. Like, yeah, yes, you, yes, most definitely. You the get, only, only thing I'll say is there's no happy fries. There's no happy okay, fries so. at McDonald's. Hey, but we're starting off with the McChicken. Take a look at the McChicken. Get it up close. I don't know if they knew we were coming today, but they made it look extra juicy. It okay. looks extra juicy. A lot of mayo, you got the lettuce, the hot and spicy McChicken. Cheers, guys. Cheers. That's good. It's actually very good. That's, that's quality right there. And we still got chicken nuggets and fries to go for $5. That's actually fire. Yeah, that's fire. And surprisingly, it does have a nice kick. It like is, there is a nice kick definitely to the hot and spicy chicken sandwich. Mm -hmm. I think it's way better than the original. It's it's beyond better. Okay, I don't really eat McDonald's that much, but honestly, for $5, this McChicken is not bad. And it comes with a drink, chicken nuggets, and fries. Yeah. I would say just a sandwich alone is $5. <laughs> and a lot of places actually, a sandwich like this would be over $5. Uh -huh especially in today's economy. But let's move on, we got the chicken nuggets. Everyone grab a chicken nugget. So the thing about McDonald's is the chicken nuggets are like, they're Michael Jordan of all menu items. Okay, That's yeah. what I've heard. Jordan's only menu item that he's ever had from McDonald's is a chicken nugget, according to him. I actually heard once that Jordan said he's never had an actual burger from McDonald's, so we'll have to make that happen one of these days. Hey, you know what that's called? What? What cap. Jordan's wearing right now. Oh, it's, a a it's a cap. It's a cap. But speaking of this chicken nugget, just the feel, the texture of it, it's like warm and very crispy. So previously yeah. when they went to uh, Burger King, right? They had to dip their chicken nuggets in the sauce. Now you can do that, it's like an extra thing here. Yeah. But you can raw dog it here and eat it and it's that good. I'm confident in it. I'm pretty confident as well too, but what is your favorite dip? Wow, well, when I was a kid, it was barbecue. Uh, as I got older, it became ranch. How about you guys? Barbecue, oh. all day. Mine was sweet and sour. Oh, sweet oh, and sour, I think okay. that's more of like an Asian thing. Yes, today, so. it is, that Polynesian sauce vibe. Oh yeah. yeah. All right guys, cheers. Nostalgic moment. Huh? Very nostalgic. I'm just pissed I don't have a happy toy. If I had a happy toy, it'd make my day, but these $5 I mean, meal deals don't come with a happy toy. If you order the, oh, to think about it, the happy meal is more expensive than the $5 meal. It is. And you That's get, actually crazy. You get more bang for your buck on the $5 meal deal. Uh -huh. So fries, McDonald's fries. The thing with McDonald's fries, you have to have them fresh. If they sit around too long, that is they get true. a little soggy, but pretty fresh. I feel I'm like not really digging it. Yeah. yeah. Like I said, you have to have them right out of the fryer, and right now they're not right out of the fryer, so I'm a little disappointed. Okay, so far the McChicken and the chicken nuggets, yeah. those have been really good. The fries, eh. Yeah. I've had better. So I think the only difference between this meal is it gives you a actual double McDouble, right? So it's a double patty. Honestly, this actually looks pretty decent. Usually they don't look that decent, the yeah. McDoubles, but for Check I don't know out. if they know we're recording or not, but it looks really good. Listen, the last time I had one of these, my heart stopped. Your heart stopped? Yeah. Came back to life. I did come back to life. You're yes. the first ever. All right, here we go. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, this might be better than the McChicken. Yeah, I can't even complain. I was looking for something to critique, but it's fire. Wow. 
Yeah. Okay, if you're ever at McDonald's and you're trying to figure out if you should get the five dollar or six dollar meal, get the six. Get the Send six. that extra dollar. You can't go wrong with both, but nonetheless, good bang for your buck here at McDonald's. So McDonald's got an overall rating of an 8.16 out of 10 for their five dollar meal deal. But we still have one more place to try, so let's head there right now. All right, up next we have Wendy's. The inside is closed due to construction, so we're gonna be ordering the drive-thru. Hello, welcome Wendy's. Would you be using the Wendy's app? I know I will not be using the Wendy's app. Okay, how can I help you? Um, do you guys have any $5 biggie bag deals? Yeah, we have the Cheater Cheeseburger biggie bag and then the other biggie bags go up in price to $7 or $8. Oh, up to $7 and $8, okay. Yeah, yeah. but the uh, Cheater Cheeseburger is still $5. Okay, can we do one of those, please? Okay. And what then, drink we like with that? Uh, can we replace the drink for a frosty? Yeah. That is a Romo life hack. Chocolate or triple berry? Uh, we can do the triple berry, please. Okay, and then what sauce would you like for the nuggets? Uh, can I do barbecue, please? And then can I also do another biggie bag as well of the of the crispy chicken? So Wendy's is a little different. They offer different tiers of biggie bags, starting at five dollars all the way up to eight dollars. This has to be something new though. I've been to Wendy's a million times. They probably just had it to recently up their prices, but they're the OGs in the game. They brought the biggie back first, the first $5 meal deal. So they better live up to expectation right here. All right, that's all I gotta say. All right, so for our final spot, we do have Wendy's and this was a little bit different compared to the other places we went to Romal. So we have a $5 biggie bag right over here, which comes with a junior cheeseburger. We also got the four nuggets, the fries, and over here at Wendy's, you can sub your drink out for dessert. Hey, so that's you get a life hack right there. This is a full meal. You get your main entree, you get your two sides, and a dessert for five dollars unbeatable over here this one's gonna be a little bit more expensive it was seven dollars for the chicken sandwich but similar to the other meal deals you get the drink chicken nuggets and you got the fries see that is very surprising because the other two spots we went to the chicken sandwich was cheaper it was a five dollar meal so this has to be better chicken and also one thing that i'm very disappointed in kamal in he got regular nuggets he did not get spicy nuggets which you can get at wendy's but let's go ahead and try the See, item. They were gonna upcharge us for that, that's why. They were not gonna upcharge you. So this was $5 right here. Typical burger, it looks, you know, ketchup, pickles. Looks like a basic burger. Basic Small. burger, but try it out, take let's a see. bite, see how it is. All right, so you had the McDouble at McDonald's. How does this compare? Very comparable to the McDouble, honestly. Taste-wise, it's up there. It's up there, it's very cheesy. That ketchup feel gives me the McDouble vibe right yes, there. Yes, yes. And you also got the pickles. You can't go wrong. But this is a solid burger. Let's try that out, the chicken sandwich right over here. Similar to the other places, you got chicken, you got lettuce, and you got mayonnaise. The only difference here is one piece of lettuce, not shredded lettuce like the other places. Yes, it is $7 though, so it is a little more expensive, a little pricier. So I'm intrigued to see how this one tastes. Maybe they use organic lettuce, who knows? Ash Jordan grabs a chicken nugget behind the scenes. I'm kind of disappointed in this one. Chicken is a little dry for the chicken sandwich. See, the presentation is ah, it's whatever. Let's see though, taste wise. Yeah. How's that chicken? It's all right, it's not too bad, not too bad. Yeah, just a little bit more on the dry side. Burger is probably what I would go to. And it's also cheaper. You save two bucks by getting this right over here. But next up, we got the, the chicken nuggets. nuggets. I, I'll open up the barbecue because that's the choice of dipping sauce that Kamal decided Listen, to get. Listen, controversial opinion, I think Wendy's nuggets are better than McDonald's nuggets. Let's try it out. See, I'm gonna raw dog this one. Oh, uh, you're gonna raw dog? Yeah, I'm a raw dog. Right, I gotta go with barbecue. Juicy. Yeah. Juicy and crispy. So you had the McDonald's nugget just not too long ago. How does this compare? This is way better. Being a fast food connoisseur, me and Kamal, we're the only fuzzers that actually eat fast food on a consistent basis, and Wendy's is always a great option for me. Wendy's is a great option. I feel like you can't go wrong. And this we do is have our last side though. Yeah, fries. this is the side that I think makes a difference compared to the other places. Wendy's has really good seasoning on their fries. McDonald's, I guess it's nostalgic, but... Plus, 100% natural cut fries. 100% natural? Let's try them out. Wow. Way better than McDonald's, way better than Burger King. Fries are top tier here at Wendy's. But lastly, the Triple Berry Frosty. A new limited addition to the Frosty 
menu as we speak, but let's try it out. Oh. The other two places did not give us dessert. This place does for $5. Let's try it out. How was it? Refreshing. Fire. I'll let you taste this, and then I'll tell you what this tastes exactly like. Okay. Let's see. Oh, that's fire. That's fire. But does it remind you of anything? It does. I just, I just can't think of it at the moment. This taste reminds me of is back to when you were a little kid. You were playing outside all day long. You come in and you get a gogurt. Yes, you're <laughs> you right. Get a yes. This tastes exactly like a gogurt, but it's more of a ice cream like texture. It's actually not bad. Surprisingly, it's very not this is pretty good. You know, I do recommend if you ever have a date, bring them to Wendy's. Bring you them to the Wendy's. Full course menu right there. Yes, you get an entree, two sides, and you get a dessert for five dollars. At Ruth's Chris, yeah. that would cost you at least a hundred. Absolutely. If you're lucky, you might get some more dessert afterwards. You might get the cherry on top. Oh, that'd be amazing. But with that being said, which spot had the best? Actually, let's rate Wendy's on a scale of 10. Honestly, other than the chicken sandwich, I think everything else is pretty good. Yeah. I'm gonna give it a nine because everything else is pretty good and you get dessert included. Yeah, I'll skip the chicken aside. I think I have to agree with Kamal. A nine is a very fair score for a fast food place. And Wendy's, they're the OGs in the game. And I think they're still the best $5 around town. Yeah, compared to McDonald's and the other spots that we had today, I think Wendy just has some beat. You know, Wendy's uh, did an amazing job today. I don't know. I mean, yeah. I feel like I feel like I know where I'm going to go on my next date. Oh, yeah, 100%. We are coming here. So the fast food giant, Wendy's, has won today's challenge. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell to be notified every time we drop those Make videos. sure you guys follow us on all the social links will be in the description below. We're the Fuzzins, and we're out. Peace. Peace. Welcome back to the Fuzzins. And in today's economy, fast food rates are super. Oh, let's try it. Welcome back to the Fuzzins, but we have three fast food giants that are currently offering a $5 meal deal. Okay, said again. $5 meal deal. Welcome back to the Fuzzins, and welcome back to the Fuzzins, and in today's economy, everything in the world has gotten so expensive, but now we have $5 meal. We have $5 meal deals. Yeah. I thought Jack in the Box, Jack in the Box was the only one. We get onion rings, onion rings. I normally don't come to the car. I normally don't come to Burger King. I'm gonna go, you might, might as well go with the hot and spicy, the hot and spicy McChicken McDeal. <laughs> the hot and spicy McChicken meal deal.